Hello everyone, this is Cherie from Thimble Book, and I hope this video finds you well. I, I have not been able to get back to my regular scheduled YouTube videos because of a serious issue that has occurred with my computer, and I am not alone in this issue, and thousands upon thousands of people have had this problem, so I figured it would be a good idea for me to just use my cell phone to record some footage and just upload directly from there to let you know what all is going on. So, when I'm not creating YouTube videos... I do a number of different jobs, including like graphic design work and those sorts of things. I was sending over a logo and some other files to a customer when I got the blue screen of death. And what I later on found out was that Windows issued an update that caused many people's hard drives to fail. Basically what it did was whenever you... Um, produce a larger file on your computer, what it does is it activates the fault that was in the Windows update and it erases all of the data on the SSD. And I spent about four days up all night um, trying to recover my drive using another computer uh, and using it externally to try to recover the files. Uh, I eventually was able to recover some files, but not all of them, because whenever I tried to open a file, it would completely uh, close out on me. Uh, so it was problematic. I thought that I would be able to replace the drive inside of my computer and that my computer would be fine after that. But actually, it was not because uh, the bio settings actually updated and it destroyed my BIOS. So in order to try to recover the machine, the only thing that would be able to be done would be to reflash the BIOS. So basically that means that I have a dead computer and I need a new computer. Um, this is not the first time that I've had a serious problem with uh, Windows and Windows updates. So I always keep those updates turned off. But the problem was is that inside of the BIOS settings, uh, there is a place for Windows inside of all uh, or basically all computers that come preloaded with Windows. There's usually a setting inside of the BIOS that turns on updates for Windows inside the BIOS. And that was a piece that I didn't turn off. So now I have a basically a ruined computer in all of my software, all of my files, everything is gone, essentially, except for the things. I do a once a week backup, but that was not enough because I had videos planned for four or five different sewing machines that recently released. Um, and now all of that content is gone and I have to start all over again. And I'm not necessarily a rich person, so it's not like I can just tomorrow just go out and purchase a brand new computer. So uh, I wanted to show you all the uh, Windows updates. It most The most popular thing that people are talking about now is the Windows 11 update. And that is the number of the update that you would look for inside your computer. And if it's there, you need to delete that and remove that from your computer. Um, also, it happened in Windows 10 as well, uh, and this is the number to that update. And I was still running Windows 10 thinking that I would be safer um, and had this update on my computer, which destroyed it. So, um, that is pretty much it. And as for me, uh, because of what has happened, I really am feeling reluctant to ever use a computer that has Windows installed on it again uh, because I've had other problems with Windows in the past. Um, and I have been a user of Linux uh, for some time, but I've never really installed it on my personal computers. I know that it would be a big deal to switch over from the softwares that I know how to use and I'm used to uh, and that I'm comfortable with, but I kind of feel like just switching and just running Linux from now on because this 
this loss was a huge loss for me uh, financially and time-wise. And I don't ever want to go through it again. Uh, I hope that this video helps you all to see. I hope you can read my handwriting of uh, this issue. And you can look at other channels on YouTube. There's loads of other channels on YouTube talking about this problem. Uh, so... For what it's worth, I hope that helps. And guys, are you all excited about all of the new sewing machines that have come out? I know that Brother Baby Lock has come out with some new offerings, as did Janome. And I'm just really excited. I was so excited to come out with the videos on that. So do stay tuned. And I'm hoping to get a new computer built uh, pretty soon here. It's going to take me some time to uh, get my funds together to do that but hopefully I will be able to do that soon and I'm just going to explore what I can do on my phone um, as far as uh, content goes this won't be my regular programming but I'll try to do what I can and I thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you on the next one peace